back, everybody. Uh, just me and uh, Victor for this round. We have Shane on the right playing Crab, and we have Jonathan playing Lion. Uh, I Man, it's, that, it's been a long time since I've seen a Lion deck <laughs> intro. You know, I was just about to say that. I'm like, man, where have we seen, haven't seen a, <laughs> a Lion yet? And here we are. All right, so uh, I think I think Jonathan is a local player. I can't I can't recall if I've seen him any local I'm, tournaments, but uh, I don't think I have. But I, I'm I don't know. Like Sh Shane's actually a little bit outside his comfort zone because, from what I understand, he played well. He he plays a lot of line and yes, dragon. Yes, he does. Yes, he but does. But he's decided to take uh, crab with him. I think it was a, just a decision choice that he opted to do. Right. He thought Something that, a little uh, bit different. yeah, no, he thought that uh, he knew that Lion wasn't gonna do okay, mm -hmm. but he he was considering about whether to go uh, Dragon, but just a crab with the resilience of it probably thought more optional for him. Oh, that's really good. Double charge and double reprieve. For Shane, yeah, you don't maul any of those, right? Oh, oh. keeps one reprieve. Interesting. Why would you? Your thoughts on that? Well, I mean, he knows what he knows what the characters are in his dynasty. Maybe he just was planning on playing them all out, or maybe it's like okay. a bunch of holdings or something okay. like that, right? That so. makes sense. Oh, that's gonna be clutch. Karate district on against lion. Yeah. You don't think so? Oh, now I remember. Now I know why he yeah. didn't well, decide. There to you go. That's why you pitched two yeah. charges because you, you don't want to charge it. Uh huh. So he's gonna start with You're a right. Kaio Envoy. All right. All right. Okay. Kaio Envoy followed by uh, a, a gun show. Yep. The gun show. The gun show. Oh, that must be reveal face up. Yep. Ooh. This, is, this is actually a really strong, nice, aggressive start from uh, Jonathan. I like it. So, I yeah. like it. Look at all this. Berserker. Oh, my goodness. And <coughs> Get some honor while you're at it. Wow, these guys play quick. I'm liking uh -huh. it. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. So he just gained an honor there? He did. With the uh, Coma Prodigy, I think it's called. Ability, that's right. Yeah. Coma Prodigy. So that was a very quick dynasty phase right there. And they're just gonna I love, this is the ring I like. Every ring looks very yeah distinct. Yeah, I like this. Well, I think that's Jonathan's. Uh, I like that. Yeah, I like it. Three, four, two, three. Okay. Ooh. So. I wonder if that's a custom dial. That looks pretty nice. So nine to thirteen? No, nine to fourteen. Oh, wrong direction. Yes, you're right. It's okay. Ooh, Talisman. That's a good card to pick up. So you can just send it to the different place. Hmm, this might be good to know. Oh, two. So that's an interesting... Yeah, uh, so uh, Aichi Wayfinder coming into play. Interesting. Uh, He's deciding to put Fade on it. I wonder why. No. Okay, he opts not to. And he gets to take a look at... Shameful oh, display. That's okay. a good one to dodge. <laughs> I like that. Well, I mean, a lot of uh, a lot of Lions provinces are actually kind of prickly as well. I think they all they run all three strength provinces. Um, Art have, of War, yeah. Feast of Famine. Do yeah. they run? No, they must run uh, Public Forum. I think. No, because no. they, they're weak on political, so they must be using not ancestral lands. Ancestral land would be the political. Medi yeah. Earth one. Uh, last one would be. Water? Rally? Is that the last one that they could potentially use? Maybe. I mean, again, I haven't seen a lot of line decks lately, so the thing, the metagame might have changed. But we're going to see Shane here poking in with the first conflict with a political, most likely. Yeah. Get that berserker not show up. I mean, yeah. sucks that it, it's going to be able to attack with it, but I yeah. mean, you can't really stop that. Well, you're also going to get the card draw, right? So Ooh, Sinso's The Art of War. Right? That's the guy that wrote it? Well, how, what, how did you pronounce it? Sun Tzu's The Art of War. Yeah, yeah. How you said sh Shinzo. <laughs> so, yeah, we got a political conflict with two strength to begin with. I suspect that Jonathan will not defend with him. <clears throat> and maybe Shane, Shane's just happy here. Just oh, actually, no, right. That, value, that guy is pretty yeah. good with a defense. 
I think the way she, uh, the way Jonathan sees it, well, if it was breaking, then he would of course maybe not defend. Of course, because it's not breaking, he's just gonna come might as well keep it around as a province to potentially. Uh... So now, actually, just a f quick flurry of cards. You got assassination on the Coma Prodigy. That's oh, after. Oh wow! That's after the uh, Force Shame got played on the. That's uh, right. Shuki. That's right. So with Jonathan not playing anything else, Shane's gonna go ahead and take a, do the trigger on the Shrewd Yusuke, looking at the top two cards of his deck. And with uh, no other, no other characters participating in conflict, how this might just be a oh, win. Oh, for shame, got it. I was like, does, how to get dishonored? Whoa, Crane. that's interesting. Crane Splash. Now, Crane used to be actually was a popular splash back during the core set days. Well, because you want to make sure you land those for greater glories, right? Yeah, yeah. If if your deck is all in on the gr for greater glory plan, then Voice of Honor is oh, definitely for sure. To get for it sure, done. you're right. Actually, I like that. So now, actually, with that, uh, that out of the way, of course, I mean. I don't think Jonathan has anything to worry about as far as Crab glo goes for preventing the For Greater Glory thing from happening. That's right, yep. But now we'll see. Uh, I mean, it's fairly obvious he's going to go for military here. We're going to see which ring he goes after. Uh, would you attack with both, or would you... I, I wouldn't attack... Uh, but then, like, Gunso really doesn't have a really good political... And again, well, Shane has a military conflict left, so that's why he held, held that's it right. so bad. That's right, yeah. <coughs> oh, so, so Shane just forgot actually, to trigger the yeah, a late fate trigger, and Jonathan uh, gracefully allows Shane to let that happen. So now we're going for the military void conflict, revealing a manicured garden. Mm, that's gonna help. Always credit or credit, fate, fate gain is always good. Until they release a card that says you lose honor equal to the fate in your pool. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Imagine that with Scorpion. <laughs> Banned. <laughs> Banned. <laughs> it's a it's a holding. Yeah. So oh. if he's gonna bump it to four with a stronghold pr trigger. Hmm. I wonder if you should even bother um, sending that over to a different uh, place. Ooh, way of the crab. Solid, solid play. Because either he sacks the, either he sacks the berserker, or he sacks the gunso, and now he doesn't have a, he doesn't have a defender for the second conflict. I like that. I like that a lot. You're right. I like it very much. You had to sack the berserker, right? It's tough, right? Because you'd be breaking yeah. this uh, the province if you didn't. But I feel like Shane had so many other ways to, yeah. most likely, had ways to stop that. For sure. I mean, I of course, with Caillou Envoy, best way of the crab uh, fodder ever. But uh, I love it. Nice. Shane drops for room of skirmisher. So Jonathan he wanted to defend the province, but isn't going to be able to because he's going to get coverted right past the. Uh, oh my goodness! And if and if Shane hits a. Uh, Feast of Emmett now? Doesn't do anything. Well, there is a fate on the Shrewd Yusuke. But, because so. Uh, oh, that's right, because he doesn't have fate. Yeah. Yeah, Feast of, Feast of Emmett, very powerful province, but. You need, to, you need to set it up properly, and I think that's why he had the Berserker, no yep. fate. Just in case mm -hmm. Shane ran into it by accident. Because what if the Art of War was actually Feast of Famine? For Jonathan sure. tries to force to go <laughs> to break it. <clears throat> there are a few scenarios where that happens, which is so funny. Right? Oh, here's the thing. He knows that's a shameful display. That's so. Oh, he's oh, like, oh yeah, he wants sure. To get that I'll away. Poke it. Yeah. Unless Jonathan plays a two cost character from his hand. I wonder if he can. Oh, there's a bonsai. I'm trying to go up to three. Nice. Like... Bonsai. Uh. Maybe assassinate. Now, well, we'll oh. see how much he goes. 
We'll see if he it does goes. He he goes up to five, okay. just in case the character shows up. Okay. <sighs> What's wrong? Oh, uh, Shane's. I guess I I I'm gonna guess he he declared the the ring, but then forgot to put it onto the province. But I assume the audio talked yeah. to saying I know yeah, what ring I'm gonna go for. We don't, we don't have for. table audio, unfortunately, so we're not yeah, able sorry to about that, listen in. But yeah, that's a yeah. that's a turn one province break against Lion, so he's actually out racing the Lion deck. And losing a very critical province too, not, not to uh, add that as well. So, I think that was. So now, J Jonathan, of course, he's free to declare his second conflict. However, it has to be political. Um, that is correct, and uh, Kudo doesn't really have good political. Yeah, and uh, Shane, you know, it's one to one. So if he decides to defend with the Aichu Wayfinder, of course, Shane has his castle, and so he's able to That's defend right. properly. So mm -hmm. Jonathan decides not to, uh, not to attack. I mean, I guess we were pretty stuck to the point, right? He could commit, but the dangers of. So the reason why he didn't attack. Was well, no, sorry. He, I was going to say the reason why I didn't attack was because he wanted to deny the favor to Shane, but uh, Shane had the had the uh, keeper initiate that was ready, so right. it contributed his glory as well as the two rings on his side. That makes sense. Okay, so initiative passes over to Jonathan. Oh my goodness, another keeper. More, more keepers, a crisis breaker gets revealed, another Ooh, Caillou envoy. Another envoy. However, uh, Jonathan's flop is actually fairly good. I mean, turn two is right when you want to see those uh, spear collars, spear collars yeah. for sure. And if now John you might, Jonathan has a uh, charge in his hand, well... I mean, he's also got a prodigy as well, so like, he can, that's a yep. way of the crab fodder. So he does indeed play the spirit caller. Yep. Just in case anyone doesn't know what that does. <laughs> very I mean, powerful, one of the very... most powerful lion cards. Oh my goodness. And having two fit on it. Also, you know, the <coughs> fact that Shane, because he's playing Crab, it's uh, very likely he's not playing Cloud the Mind. Crab doesn't have a lot of. Uh, no. I believe their only two Shigenjas are Witch Hunter and the newest uh, Shigenja. The one that meditations as a defender. Yeah, I know the one you're talking about. <coughs> I can't remember the name, though. It's unique, isn't it? Isn't she? I think so. Yeah. So I can't tell what Shane bid, but it looks like he gained one one honor, so it looks oh, like... Oh, he, he moved it. One. Moved it. One. Thank you. Thank you. Is he so he could hear you? Okay. So, pre-conflict. Uh, pass? Sorry, I didn't... Uh, I assume it was a pass. Oh, my... Now that's going to be a... Oh, okay, unicorn. So we saw a crab with a scorpion that we see with the unicorn, and we'll see how Well, this we one... knew that already because he played the Ayuchi Wayfinder. Oh, yes. Yeah, so sorry, I should have noted that when uh, it initially got played. But... And we know Jonathan's not playing in let go, so... <laughs> Unlike all the other spy glasses we saw played on yes. the crab side, no longer or yes, exactly. Or like, oh yeah, this time it's actually going to stick around. <laughs> that glass is mine. <laughs> okay, political conflict first. I'm probably can. Huh. 
Air, huh? So with the Akoma Prodigy, it's going to be two. Hmm. Did no one can in pro favor? I think Shane has it. Can't, can't tell what he has it on. I can go confirm. No, that's fine. Maybe it'll point. It'll present itself. <coughs> So, defending with Shurjusuki puts him at one defense. And it is a military, but so that's not going to be relevant. The Ooh, favor. reproof's going to be nice. Skirmisher's nice, too. Um, yeah, okay. <laughs> Good thing Shane stopped. Uh, otherwise, I would have went over there and asked him to put those cards aside. Do you try to protect it with... What are you trying to protect? Like, do you try to protect a Shred Yusuke uh, with a reprieve or something so that you know it doesn't die, or you just kind of wait for it to go uh, until... I think, I think you reserve the reprieve for your witch hunters and all the other things that could potentially die from being voided or whatnot. That sounds like a good but, idea. But uh, it looks like uh, Jonathan wins that conflict, the air conflict. Yeah. And Steal he gains, an honor. steals an honor from Shane. Mm -hmm. So putting a little bit... Oh, sorry. Shane should have... Five. Five. Okay. Fire? Ooh. That seems risky. So while, while the spear color is in play, I mean, based on the first turn, there isn't anything hugely uh, as huge and annoying on the... Uh, the only stuff is the, the commander. What's his name? Yeah, the one that you draw a card if you win a combat. That's right, yeah. yeah. Not the kind of thing I want to... <laughs> but I mean, if you got to do it, you got to do it, right? Yep. So here we go. Military conflict, water. Coming down. Who wants to show up to that, though? Do you just do a little poke? Well, or I mean, I would probably send it? the Crisis Breaker because... But do you want to break it, though? Oh, against the Art of War? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you might as well. I mean, it doesn't, doesn't make any sense to, to do a... Well... I don't know if you were going to. Because there's a few provinces that you kind of just want to farm off of value. Yeah. And then you only want to break it once it's about to. I think, lose. though, because Shane seems to have a tempo advantage that he wants to press. He wants it. just to end it yeah. as soon he's rather already than got, later. He's already got one province broken. Once, you know, that's also true because um, if. Right. Uh, John starts getting good characters into the um, discard, then. Spare color becomes even more better value, yeah. right? Yeah. So four, yeah, four to start. And John looks like he's not going to defend, as I probably guessed. Let's see if he plays anything mitigate. I guess he, you know, you might be thinking, sure, I might, I might draw the three cards, but now on the other hand, he could, yeah. See, the other reason he want to let it break is because he wants to Turi to go to the discard pile. That's but look right. at this, Shane Smart. He's like, no, you can keep that there. I know you have a spear collar in play. <laughs> so you can, you can toss it next turn. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want you to do it right now. Yeah. Not right now. Thank you very much. You, you want to reanimate a Berserker, that's fine. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Why don't you just get the uh, a Kurugunso with a yeah. honor? Or Is he at 13 or 14? He should be at 13 now because oh, he was undefended. Awesome. Yeah. Unopposed. Hmm. So now Jonathan has the uh, opportunity to do a military conflict. 
the oh, first oh, uh, oh. launch commander. That's that's a nice one because. Oh man, this crisis breaker is getting out of hand. It's getting big. And that thing is going to stick around for a while because I figure. No, with, it's that's the like, reprieve that's, target. Yeah, too. reprieve yeah. target. He also has a reprieve in his hand too. And who knows, right? Like, who knows what what attachments are sitting in John's hand that he can't play because of Karada District. That's right. Yeah. So one, two, two, three, 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 uh, three. It's two, right? Because uh, zero. So two. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. Oh my God, math is hard. So we're definitely going to see a uh, probably a, an exhaust from the spear caller. But, but he was no. I Shane, thought, can't you only do that when you're losing? Yes, you need to have less yeah. uh, military. So yeah. Shane might have actually screwed himself a bit. But on the other hand, like you're going to proper, you're going to defend, right? Well, no. Think about this. If if Jonathan lets us go, yeah, then he wins the conflict. Huh? What is that? I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna go go up to three, and then the crisis breaker shows up, draws another card. Yeah. And then gains one, two, three, four, four. So one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, one sec. <coughs> Sorry, there was just a misinterpretation of the uh, current state of hand. So, uh, Jonathan's up at three. He plays yeah. uh, strength in numbers to send the crisis breaker back home, saying, right. Go home, you're drunk. <laughs> So, so right now we're at three to two, right? That's correct. Yeah. <clears throat> because Jonathan doesn't want to lose a bunch of honor every time he plays a card. Yeah. That is not a place to be. <laughs> Sorry, but he did lose an honor from that. Sorry, I was doing some administrative it's okay. stuff. It's so okay. It's okay. It's okay. I've been keeping up with the thing. Mm -hmm. No, no. I just got back anyway. Ooh, policy debate. Oh, I was gonna say policy debate on the with the <laughs> berserker, but he's doing it with the. With Are you the envoy with spirit caller? Yeah. Zero or oh, zero one. I can't tell what he bid, but yeah, most likely yeah. Did. Double ones. So we see a talisman in his hand. That's a potential target to strip. I think Chain has two. Two two uh, talismans. Talismans, yeah. We see a charge as well, but you don't want to charge a uh, keeper in the ship. So it takes a repeat. Smart. Smart play. Just make sure that it doesn't last another mm -hmm. turn. Yeah. <clears throat> so winning but not breaking. I would actually send this to a different player. Yeah. You, if you were Shane, you play a, you play a talisman. Yeah, talisman and send it to a different area. Yeah. Trigger the ability. Yeah. First he's gonna pump, so now he's actually winning. To bring so him up four to four to three. Yeah. yeah. Now John can just respond by using his stronghold as well. To go four to four. <clears throat> hmm. <laughs> Shane's not deciding. Hmm. I wonder where I should send you. <laughs> oh, strength of one or army of one? Is oh, one? wow. We're going to six. A legion. If it had feet, that would have been sick too. Yeah. But still, it's a good. Uh, it's a pretty good bonsai. Yeah, I mean, I t when I so first saw that card spoiled, I just I didn't think it was very good. I was mm -hmm. like, oh, I'll just play Bonsai instead. But if you if you have for greater glory, or if you have stuff like uh, Feast or Famine or something yeah. like that to counter it, yeah. for sure. So back to winning, but he still needs another two. Uh, oh, let's it go. Yeah. You know, that's also a strategic idea that um, <coughs> players do as well, where. Um, right. 
you just pass so that you, you don't give your opportun- uh, opponent an opportunity to have an action back. Right, right? yeah, because they're, they're expecting you to do something so they can respond. That's right. But if you exactly. just go, yeah, nah, that's like, fine. That's yeah. okay. No way. <laughs> Not going to have that happen. So, let's see. Crisis Breaker can now do political, which is still pretty good. Two political. Yeah. And no, you get to, three you, political. You get to trigger the spyglass, too. Ah, oh, shucks. Yeah, Sorry. you're right, actually. Yeah, okay. that's I will, that's right. I know it's too late, but yeah, we're just you're right. Uh, we missed that, but uh, that's also uh, the responsibility of Shane. So we're just gonna have to let it stand. Like too many things have happened since uh, since the conclusion of that. Wow. What happened? Actually, what? Yeah, has have any? I'm sorry. Oh, he's already drawn. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to go stop that. And then also bring up the other thing too. Yeah. 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 All right. I'm. Uh, I'm really glad that the chat is <laughs> is participating because there's a lot of stuff that we have to track on our side as well. So we need to make sure that uh, everything is kosher. Yeah, so right now, uh, actually, head judge Graham was watching the match. They're gonna, they're going to, they're going to fix the situation now. So yeah, what what Graham is uh, head judge Graham is asking because what they're going to do is they're going to have to reshuffle the card back into the deck, and Graham has to ask first: Is there any has been any deck manipulation? Because what you want to do is you want to preserve the order of the deck as much as possible, uh, while still randomizing the top so that Shane doesn't know what he's about to draw because. Shurisuki was used twice in previous turns. We know the bottom two cards for the deck, so we're going to preserve those two. Uh, so, uh, Watson says, sorry for the mess. Don't worry about it. We really appreciate that you pointed that out. Obviously, this is not a, a, a true Nationals, but we do want to, want to see uh, tight play on camera. So, you know, uh, helping out with that stuff. First we verify, then we fix. If it happened too late, then of course. But, yeah, thank you so much for pointing that out. So it, looked like a, so it looks like a political rival just got played on Jonathan's side. <laughs> All right, sorry, gang. I'm returned. What have I missed? <clears throat> Not much. I just explained uh, what what Graham's remedy was and how he preserved the bottom of the deck when reshuffling. Oh, perfect. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, probably follows over there. Probably fixing the spyglass thing too. Yeah. And then okay. Uh, so we're still attacking void political. Um, number is I assume better than enough because it's broken. <laughs> What? How do you do that? Oh, he tossed a political rival with no fate. Wow. He tossed a political rival with no fate? Not in the conflict. To uh, get yes. it with value. Yeah, nice. Wow. That is... That's a that's a very heads-up play oh, by Jonathan. Geez. Of course, the problem is now is that he has three broken provinces, and now the strongholds but, but open I mean, to attack. Like, but yeah, look, I get really it. Really good. Shane's entire board's about to leave right now. That's true. Yeah, As Shane's entire board's about to leave. He's going to lose one honor because of the Shrugisuki going away. Oh wow, this is going to yeah. be very different and, now. And in addition to the, rep- <coughs> and then he also got rid of the reprieve, so he can't yes. even save it. I think that's, that's why Jonathan was landing yeah. the. Um, what? No. Oh, maybe he has another reprieve in his hand. So he does have a second. Oh, reprieve. Jonathan must have seen two, and he just couldn't take the other one. Yeah. Okay. 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 Still, still, that's a really good, uh, really I, good play by oh my, Jonathan. That, if if it wasn't for that reprieve. Yeah. Sure, sure. John lost three provinces, but yep, I don't mind. We're about to attack you, and you can lose two. Absolutely. Right? Yeah. That, yeah. that was a well, uh, well orchestrated. With a piece of famine, I like that a lot. 
So Jonathan is going to have to play a little bit more defensive. However, mm -hmm. because of the political rivalry, I mean, the door is a little bit open for a p potential dishonor. Uh, mm -hmm. Now Shane's dishonor victory. most likely going to just bid one because Pyglas is going to just keep him in cards, right? Yep. Yep, so four plus seven is 11. Okay, Karada still showing up, just making sure that all of John's attachments do not get uh, any input. Oh, look at that. Vanguard Warrior says, I'm sticking around for another turn. Uh, I just gotta look up, uh, uh, I gotta look up Caillou and Boy quickly. What's up? All right. So, uh, Caillou Envoy, courtesy and sincerity, they're mandatory, right? But they're missed opportunities. That's correct. Right. So, yeah, if if he if he took the fate, but he didn't draw a card. I mean, you saw us intervening in the match, uh, but that was just because there are certain things that need to be the board Addressed. state. Yeah. But in the case of something like that, which is effectively a missed trigger, it's not mandatory, then uh, yeah. we're not going to interfere. It's, Players will, yeah. I mean, Shane, Shane technically it, it is right? a beneficial trigger, regardless yes. of how many cards there are left in the yeah. conflict deck. So if... I believe it wasn't not the player's intent to intentionally miss the trigger. Right. Because there's no, you know. Yeah. But still, that's. Uh, I'll have to check what the, about that. But as of this current state. <laughs> hmm. Watson Hasaki talks about stream policing. Well, we're not necessarily stream policing. So this, the way this event is working, we got Graham the head judge. Uh, yep. However, uh, now is that mandatory? The honor? Yeah. It's a it's a reaction, so it's not okay. mandatory. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, um, for, as you're discussing. Yeah, yeah. Here. So uh, I I I didn't have a chance to watch all of this uh, Paris stream, so I'm not, I don't know specifics about it. But uh, Graham is the head judge, but we're operating in multiple halls today, so sometimes he's not available to answer a judge call or rectify a situation. So. Uh, my co-commentator Sung Ho has been deputized to any any um, any relatively minor uh, things that happen that are things like board state, incorrect board state, stuff like that. That uh, incorrect board state, yes. we we have to fix that. But mm -hmm. anything like missed triggers, we're just going to let it stand, and it does fall under the missed opportunity section of the rules document. And unfortunately, now, yeah, Kawais, yep. yeah, and so Kawais asks if he's not honoring his general. Again, that reaction is not mandatory. Reaction abilities are not mandatory unless stated so on the card itself. So, uh, if he missed his opportunity, he did not honor it. So, Roma Ambusher coming into play. Oh, this is going to be pretty key because yep. dodging that honor general is going to be very important in this yep. final attack to the stronghold. Oh, skirmisher, not ambush. Which most likely is ancestral yep. lands. Oh, looks like <coughs> Jonathan being the on, uh, yeah. player he is, allowing Chain to, or yeah. Chain allowing Jonathan to set up on the. Yeah, and again, uh, Again, the to add to the missed opportunities section, if your opponent lets you do it and it's in a timely manner, yep. then it's allowed. Yeah. As long as it's within a time frame that yep. it's no longer. So here we go. So first, uh, okay. I assume sending all four. Yeah. There's no like. Did they bid? Did they do? Yep, one one. A oh, one. I didn't even. I missed that. Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Interesting. It's keeping the <laughs> all in, <clears throat> all the marbles. Yeah, I mean, not, kind of like all the marbles. One, two, three, four, five, eight? six, seven, eight. Yep. And nine? Is that uh, the one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Yeah. You are correct. Okay. So Earth is five. Political or Earth five. Mm -hmm. Stranglehold two. So seven. And it is ancestral. Land. Ancestral. Lands. I mean, Lion is not renowned for their political yeah. value, so it's also I five, get it. It's also a five strength. It's province, very right? nice, so. yeah. Uh, what's the province that uh, John's uh, missed? I'm trying to remember. Well, air? Yeah, okay. So. 
Yeah, it would be their fertile fi- sorry, fertile fields or Mega Garden. Garden. Yeah. No, I was just wondering, like, could he have hit anything? You know? did, did, is he defending with the gun? So? Uh, that's a good question. I can't tell. We'll see in a second. Yeah. Of course, uh, Kota Tuturi is in uh, is in the discard pile. So yes. if he really needs yeah. to the additional help, he can summon Tuturi. <laughs> summon. Okay. okay, now here's a proper use of the Legion of One ability. We're going up to eight. Going up to eight. Oh, man, that's going to be great. Yeah. Okay, so that's a good start. I see a charge, but no targets in chain side. Those are, are going to be great next turn. <laughs> yeah. So now Shane is going to remember, yep. hey, watch Commander. You do lose an honor for that, so down to 10. Of course, Jonathan's in no danger of losing his honor. Or losing I would do a honor. policy debate here. On John's side? No, uh, for Shane. I see. I know it's danger because you kind of want to go high, but mm-hmm. John also wants to go low because maybe he doesn't have cards he doesn't want or doesn't care about. No. Maybe it is good to not actually play it either. Right. That's risky. Four honor. If you go too high, then you're like, oh no. But if you go too low, you lose cards yourself. That's true. Yeah. So I think, I think they're gonna decide to not use it. I just continue as is. You know, like make Jonathan commit something to make uh, go as such. Okay. So it looks like Jonathan opted to say that's okay. Oh, got dishonored as what the uh, the pride ability. Pride ability, sometimes good. Oh, wow, that's uh, ooh, that that's a, that was a relevant card because he did yeah, have uh, an honor and uh, Kitsuki spear caller. He has two honor. Yeah. Yes. So if uh, if like Shane wanted to try to do a way of the crab, that would have helped a lot. He did, however, get two keeper initiates out of the deal. So yes. So now that some John, defenders, John like. Probably doesn't want to do a military complex. Yeah, I mean, those political. You have political vibes. Just gonna show up. You just, I think you just do a political conflict with uh, your spirit color and your thing, and no, you go maybe just prodigy and pot rival. Yeah, and then you because go after Karada District. So exactly. if he has a bunch of attachments in his hand, it unlocks them all yes. to being played. I know John probably knows that there is a. He knows there's talents, but right. you have to like make a play it right. You're not going to just be sit behind that and just wait until twiddling your thumb, per se. For sure. <coughs> so, what do you think? Military with Honor General and Prodigy? And then keeping back Spirit Caller? And I don't like that. Well, it looks like... Looks like he's going to attack with Prodigy and Honor General? Yeah, with air. To for, try to force air. the... Uh, Oh, wait. Water. That makes Water, a lot more okay. sense. Shameful display is the province. Oh, dear. Okay. And this is this is a Coma Prodigy and Honor General? Are they are attacking? That is correct. So I believe it's six because five for the General yep. and then one for the Prodigy. Going up to six. No Defenders or maybe with uh, some Prodigies. But well, I would keeper, definitely sorry, de- defend with a Keeper because you have Shameful Display. You honor your, your keeper. That's plus two strength right there. You could also even just bring your crisis breaker and honor him too. That's true. Yeah. You'll just defend with like maybe one or two guys. And then mm-hmm. now probably at this point, I think Shane should. Okay. I was thinking either defend with him or use his ability before it gets assassinated. Yeah. Or something like that. Now, maybe that would be a little bit less incentivized if a crisis breaker with a uh, watch commander shows up, because then that's forty percent of your honor just lost. <coughs> I think I think if assassinate wasn't John Ten, he would have used it during Wade. the first conflict. Yes, that's right. But he is going to use the the crisis breaker yep. to move it into play. So this is now Using one, two, three, four, Wars. five, six, seven. Six. Uh, so three, four, five, six. Yep. Yep. Okay. Do you bring in Tatori saying, hey, what's up? Yeah, right? Try to it, break yeah. in? Yeah, if you have uh, Way yeah. of the Lion, for sure. Oh, no, yeah. no better target, right? Oh, yeah. That's right. It's going to be pretty key. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what we're going to see. Hi, Nice. That's plus seven. Tutori. 
It's plus six, seven, yeah, because of the honor general. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering, do you dishonor the Tatori? Because you could dishonor the general and make him go down to... Um, it would be the same uh, effect, oh. minus three, right? No, well, think about it. If he doesn't want to run into yeah. uh, Voice of Honor, maybe it is good to do the... Oh, uh, that is true, yeah. But now it's eight to ten, or sorry, ten to... You know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> So he's going to need to uh, to beat this conflict by five. Oh, yeah. Solid policy. Maybe. Oh, so he needs to remember about the honor loss. I wonder if he'll remember. Yeah, of course. Again, watch Commander. It is, a, a, it is an unlimited reaction, but it is, it is something that... Based uh, on the players, yeah. must remember to do. Maybe, perhaps, they'll do it after the thing, but... I believe you have to do it before it was it goes well, through. Well, yeah, again, it's uh, it's up to his opponent, right? Yeah, of course, yeah. of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that might be not so bad. We do a policy bay back with uh, yeah. Crisis Breaker Honor, so that's four compared to Tatori Zero. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay, before it goes away. I like that. So we're going up to 13. 13. <coughs> Send him in. That's another 4. So that's 12. Let's see if he's doing it. Yeah, he's Looks dragging like he him is. in. Yep. Making it 12. So Jonathan's still winning. Uh, getting a double water trigger is actually pretty good here. Yes. Because you can ready your, your gun so and your spirit collar. Mm -hmm. Spirit collar is 5 political, so... Yeah. So, I think, now that we already used in Shameful this way, we should probably go to a different province, perhaps, like a Meditations, to knock off the fade off of the Honor General. For sure, yeah. I like Seems that. Seems like a good play. Mm -hmm. He's probably checking where, where it is. Yeah, so it changes <coughs> asking, hey, can I look at my province? Defend Ooh. the wall. Okay, so that's actually, if he can... No, like, no. Medi like there's nothing to ready himself, right? Because right? Right. All, all guys or... Any relevant characters are in this conflict right now. So meditations with Dao is the uh, the province that gets moved to. It's going to be good for uh, helping clear clear the board on Jonathan's side. I, yeah, I, I I agree. Oh, I'm sorry, just gotta. And Jonathan answers the bonsai. Okay. Taking off an honor, yep. getting plus four. They can lose another one. So he's at eight, eight. now. Eight honor. Right, because of the watch the, commander, yeah, so watch commander. Shane finally remembers. <coughs> now going to fade off. Yep. Like so, that. Yep. 17 to 12. Um, yep, go up to 15. Plus three, right? Yep. So we were, we were forcing the not break. This has been a very involved conflict. It's going to be super interesting now that Shane yeah. also has a copy of... Uh, the, the Mountain, mountain does, does Not Fall. Yeah, The Mountain Does Not Fall. Now, he probably wants to policy to be first to make sure this does resolve. Paying a fate at this time when he has not a lot. That's, right. Yeah. Well, I guess he says, I don't care. I'll just do it now. now. Now, what are the chances he has a third Voice of Honor in his hand, though? Right? Perhaps. You're right. Yeah. But, yeah, you're right. <clears throat> now I wonder if well that's I think we can talk about that when it comes up. so he decides oh okay sorry I, I not sure why that not sure why that car was changing zone so many times but I, I don't know what uh, sorry I, I turned away for a second so it looks like a resolution on the <clears throat> on the mountain does not fall oh on the, the talisman crisis but it make sense did he say talisman one? I don't know. He he uh, he took the card and he pointed at the talisman okay. with the card. So who knows? Oh, weird. So it looks like uh, it looks like uh, so a win, but no brick. But yep. that's fine. Getting the boys back up. So yeah, ready and kids spear collar and the gun so with uh, a Koto Taturi's ability. Yes. Whew. That was one strong conflict. Yep. And and it was a break, but damn. And then he loses another honor for Taturi going away. Mm -hmm. So actually, I mean, geez, I think when he started this turn, he was at like 11 honor or something. So 
that's what Watch Commander does. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Captain, my captain, give me your honor. Now, John would have lost more if she didn't remember it, but... Alpha Charlie says that he chose that one because it couldn't be bowed by the water ring. Uh, that's right. That makes sense, yeah. That's right. Yep. Heads up. Sure. Event says, I don't price bow, but ring says, I don't care. <laughs> Man, my, my kingdom for a table microphone. <laughs> Fortunately, that, that table microphone is being used for uh, the X-Wing. X-Wing stream right now. Eh, you know, more popular game than us. Oh, what's that? What's that? That sounds like someone's microwave dinner is ready. Oh, well, my lean cuisine's <laughs> ready to go. <laughs> Okay, so pass, pass. Uh, yeah, let's see if Shane remembers. Yep, does remember to use a Vanguard Warrior on the Crisis Breaker. Yeah, the one with all the value. Yep, yep there he is. Are we about to go to Second Conflict? Yes, I think it's now Shane's turn to declare a Second Conflict. Okay, It's okay. going to be a political conflict okay. this time. I just don't... Oh, yeah, okay. Because his first conflict was against the Stronghold. That's with right. His yes. all-in play, so... Yep, no, you're right. I just, um, it, I blanked for a second. I'm like, well, who went where? <laughs> Um, do you send the crisis breaker or do you keep it as a blocker that will be coverted the talisman of the sun did get used right it did yeah so well if if it does show up again because he he's, he hasn't bowed it yes so we'll just have to remember that for when uh, if he tries to do it again yes if if Shane end up trying to do it then I'll yep. have to intervene but I'm pretty sure Shane does know that he already used it. I mean, normally with that kind of... <laughs> you know, card. the funny thing is this is almost a free poke because I feel like Jonathan really needs to... Because at this point we're at... We have 13 minutes left in the game. Yeah. And if if the game does somehow get to time, then Shane, Shane most wins. likely will win based on the number of provinces broken. Yep. So Jonathan, Jonathan might let... He, he might need to let Shane have this conflict, even if he's not breaking, just to, mm -hmm. yeah, just so that he can start breaking provinces on his own. <laughs> just a little poke. Yeah. Little poke. Pokey pokey. <laughs> Perhaps he's Shane's also attacking with an air ring so that Jonathan, there's no incentive for him to try to go with a yeah. ring that has fate on it, right? To eliminate the option of saying, oh yeah, there's this ring that you might want to do against me. Right. Don't do it, please. So I would... <clears throat> now, that's that's not clear if he's defending with the spear caller. That's a good question. So court games. I believe it's no defender. Oh, no, it is. It is. It is. It is. So three to one. So three to one now, yep. With that court Four games play. In. Oh, going up to three. We're going up. This keeper's like, oh, man, it's a hot day today. Gotta get that fan. <laughs> Fanny! <clears throat> and the spear caller has already used its ability. Yep. So it looks double, like a double, yep. double honor. Okay. You go military or political. So Shane took two honor there, right, with the air. Of course. Yeah. yeah. He needs to soften the p p cushion. Now I think what hmm. what John can do he can go um political void knock off a fade off the um, yep. crisis breaker so it only lasts one more turn mm -hmm. we're going into what province sorry I don't know where uh did he, oh, he's, he's holding, holding the ring. on to okay. the ring. Yeah, he hasn't decided where to go yet. Yeah, he's holding on to the void ring. <laughs> I like that. I like that attack. Sure, it won't break yet. He's threatening that he needs yeah. to defend. Uh, Lion doesn't have a lot of buffs, and yeah, Shane's. 
Shane <laughs> showing us that. But it's still, he needed to play it. Otherwise. So I'm assuming he coverted the Crisis Breaker there with I that attack. I would imagine so, yeah. yes. All right. So oh, three to one. <clears throat> Oh no, both are coming in. Oh, he wants to get the pride off of a. Uh... So we're gonna start with the court games. I think honoring his his guy. Mm -hmm. Three to three. Not a lot of line pumps, so he's just gonna let this happen. He'll remove the fade off the uh, crisis breaker. Yeah. <laughs> That was ah, a, but that Chris bringer has been around since the beginning of the game, hasn't it? It has. <laughs> yeah. Does, yeah, does get the pride ability off the Kota Gunso, so it's re-honored. But uh, like you said, with the exception of his political rival, Jonathan's board is going away. And now they're just deciding, trying to figure out who has the favor. And I think uh, Shane retains it, yeah. Shane, Shane retains it. Because they both have, uh, they both have the same Imperial amount Palace, of glory. But yeah. Crisis Breaker has right. one glory. Yes. So he will win. <laughs> Imperial favor, not political favor. Yep. That Rip Breaker. Rip. Okay. So, Jonathan being the star player now. Oh my. Okay. Do you still hold on to the Imperial Palace now? I kind of want a guy for a charge, right? Yeah, I think you're. I think you're right. They're thinking about it. Oh. Now, now John's like, all oh, my attachments. Are the floodgates. Oh, I'm ready to go. He's <laughs> like, <laughs> he just goes, he goes, military conflict, political rival. Katana, Katana, Katana. I can't go military. You mean political. Fan, 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 fan. Yeah, yeah, sorry, yeah. Fan, 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 fan. Oh. oh. If he kept the heat and go, if he kept the yeah. karate, that would have been plus four. Yeah. yeah. What am I sick? Yeah. I mean, you you can't know, right? You can't know these oh, things. I agree, I agree. Oh, oh this flop is that. very unfortunate for John. The Akoma Yukaji Yujaki is mocking him. Oh, man. Yo, well, where, where, where your favor at? Where's your favor, favor bro? Yo, yo, come on, man. <laughs> yeah. You jerk. Well, it looks like, uh, yep. Just a uh, pay three from Mitsu uh, Benoe, I think. Matsu Biona. 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 I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm sorry. To say. <laughs> <laughs> She's my bae. Hey, uh, and then uh, <laughs> Satoshi. <laughs> Good old Satoshi. Now the thing is, the funny thing is, I think all the keeper initiates are in, either in play or in the discard pile on Shane's side. No, I believe uh, he only has two. Like two in his list or two? No, two currently. Uh, okay. So I assume John passed. Makes sense. There's nothing to buy. Oh, didn't even trigger the staging grant. Well, okay. I mean, that makes sense. I'm surprised he bought all those characters. I, w I wonder if he has charge. Oh, John? Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, go up like three, four. This is going to be the last turn, right? Yeah. Yeah, with the time left, for sure. What do you think? Three? On Shane's side? Whoa, I did not expect that. I did not expect that. Now Jonathan's No, but John needs pressure. cards to make sure that he doesn't lose the military. Makes sense that he wants to go high. I wonder if the, I wonder if he's aware of the time left though, because I mean, it, not that I advocate slow play or anything, but even if Shane doesn't break the province, all he has to do is just uh, quote stall, and by stall I mean just you don't have to you don't have to go all in on the province break, just sort of yeah. Just attack enough so that he has to commit a significant, well, at least one of his guys, so that he can attack back and break a For sure, for sure. Shane just needs to Political either that or just fire. Go We're coverting. Ooh. Oh, both. 
Oh, okay. Maybe oh. he doesn't know how much time is left, so he needs to start breaking some provinces. Have you heard us saying we don't have much time? I think the, I think the judge uh, said there was some time. There was, uh, wasn't much I time left, so. <laughs> okay, so Toshi, highest value, make him get out of there. Yeah. I like that. <sighs> The fan keeper and the keeper with honor. You don't need to. Like, that that send too seems many. like a good plan. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want to send too many guys to defend it. Right. Otherwise, uh, then you can't really break his. Now, interesting that he doesn't want to even opt to keep any guys around. Right. Like, maybe he does have um, For an alternative war? plan. No, oh, yeah. well, only can be done during military military conflict. So, like. He's talking with everybody. <clears throat> See, maybe maybe he knows too. I can't I can't tell if this is him blocking with everybody. It looks like it. No, I think he's still deciding. Nope. Saying he's a guardian and Satoshi just chill. Yep. Defend with all three. Oh, I like this because um, think about it. Imagine, imagine. Oh, he's gonna move to defend the wall. Right? He's he's going to That's move right. with the talisman. He's exactly. going to move it to defend the wall and then yeah. maybe dishonor or something or whatnot. So, yeah. so first he's going to trigger the shameful display. So we just want to update the value. Yep. It's three, six, eight. eight? Okay. Oh my god, now the, now the attachments start showing up. Yeah, Come right. Come on, here we go. <laughs> go to seven. seven, seven, seven. Yeah. <laughs> the floodgates. Yeah. I like that. Okay, plus three 11. on the, the Shizo, the Shiro, whatever. <laughs> I can look it up. It's Yojin no Shiro, right? No, not that one. <laughs> nope, that's his. That's Jonathan Stronghold. It is Shiro Nishiyama. Nishiyama. Yeah, that's it right there. Oh my God, look at these I just know Shiro yeah. means castle and... Uh, <clears throat> You jelly man? I'm pretty jelly right now. Look at, look at the cream one. But why is it the scorpion one feels the best? <laughs> anyway, court games gets played. Uh, maybe he's deciding to rehonor. Hasn't used the talisman yet though, but he is going to rehonor being. It's going to bring him up to nine. Still needs to do a little bit more work to uh, to guarantee the break. I'd go somewhere else. Or even just win the conflict. Oh, we're going. Here's a Satoshi trigger. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what he was looking for. Maybe he was looking for another Satoshi? Yeah. No, it's not Nevermore. You gotta do a face up. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Oh, I like this too, because then Hida Guardian boost plus four. I mean, that's probably was. No. Oh, no, no. Well, unless no, he really needs about, No, I think he's thinking about You, you don't need too. anything right now. You gotta. No, I, mean, you just I think let, he's pointing saying I should keep it uh, for the plus. You get, I mean, it's Jonathan's turn to make a move. He needs to do something, wants to win, so. Right. Doesn't look like he, he does it, so. Uh, Shane wins the conflict. Makes sense. And now there's nothing now, on Jonathan's side. That's again another point that I wanted to bring up. Yeah. Shane didn't want to use his talisman to open another opportunity. Either. But you you think he would have done it though? Make it, I, mean, I don't it feels think it's like, I don't think it's yeah. all that necessary, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, at this point, you kind of have to just go with all all plays kind of thing. Now military, military. All five of our players. Oh, looks like that's time. I oh. guess our time was a little bit off, so. So.